Well, apparently there's some rumors that Kirsten Cinema believes her particular brand of bipartisanship will make her a good candidate for president in 2024. <laughs> what? Oh, Cinema, let me tell you something. O.J. Simpson's got a better shot of getting into couples therapy than you do of getting into the White House, all right? Who's been telling you that? Well, who are you going to court? The middle? You know what most people in the middle do? Argue about celebrities on the internet. You know what they don't do? Vote and care and shit. So, good luck with that. And when it comes to the two sides, neither one of them can stand you. You think conservatives are going to support you? You're, you're a bisexual woman with glasses who wears purple wigs and stuff. They'd rather vote for a goddamn pontoon boat. Okay? Because unless you're that particular brand of Fox News anchor woman that they can easily envision holding a casserole on the cover of a 50s magazine, they ain't gonna fuck with you. All right? End of story. And when it comes to the left, you spent every waking moment of your Senate tenure dreaming up new and exciting ways to piss us off and ruin our plans. So why would we back you? But you know, it didn't have to be that way. Early on in your career as a politician at the state level, you were a radical. That's right, openly bisexual, refused to swear on a Bible, vocal critic of the war in Iraq. That's like a damn transgender anarchist in 2000s terms. If you'd have kept that up and we had an actual progressive senator who looks like a Portland librarian, we might could have done something with that, but no. You had to go to one too many of them big money blood sacrifice parties and sell out quicker than a Nashville country artist so you could forget that shit. I don't know what you're going to be doing when your term is up. Maybe looking at speaking fees at hedge funds or write a book nobody's going to give a damn about or whatever. But whatever it is, A, it ain't going to be nowhere near the White House. And B, if it means that your sorry turncoat puppet ass will no longer be roaming the halls of Congress, it can't come soon enough. So, bye.